Hello everybody, my name is Stratex and welcome back to Star Sector. So yesterday everybody, we went and did a, quite a lot of battles against the uh, various factions of Star Sector and we kind of, we survived, we survived. We may have lost a few ships here and there, but they got repaired afterwards, it's fine. <laughs> Though our Gus currently has like 5 D mods, but don't worry about it, it's not a problem. So we're going to be heading back towards the Erebus system and I'm going to see if I can kill this task group, because I think we can do it everybody. Now it does look pretty scary, and it's also been rated as a, sh a fleet bigger than mine, but if I actually look at it, it's a carrier base fleet with some pretty mediocre slow ships so I reckon we can probably take it down with our faster more nimble ships which we can hopefully weave around the enemy and destroy them so let's go and do this right away don't worry about that guys don't interdrip me I'll come to you it's fine move to engage 63% difficulty I'll take that and let's go in we're also I think only two levels away from getting the perk that actually repairs demos passively. So hopefully once we get that, we can get rid of all these damaged ships, which would be great. Okay, let's just send us some commands. I've called in a few small ships at the start because they actually capture the points where the carriers, of course, are too grand to do so, so they don't even bother. I have also looked at some of the ship designs between episodes, and this one, I the only thing I changed was I just removed the wink on uh, sweep because it wasn't that good, really. <laughs> it is cool having your named fighters in the game, but let's be honest, everybody, 50% reduction in range, it's not great for a carrier that's already got very little range anyway, so. Okay, there are some enemies being spied. Oh, it's my original flagship. He's still okay. For now. <laughs> I probably just jinxed him. He's probably going get blown up by, like, a nuclear missile from somewhere. Oh, that is beautiful. Good job, guys. Good job. Okay, let's call in some additional reinforcements. Now, we have a lot of carriers anyway, so does the enemy. But we're going to try and use our carriers to just nit nitpick and destroy a lot of their enemies as we go along. We've got to be quite careful though, because the main enemy has two battle carriers and an onslaught battleship. So we've got, we've got to be careful with those ones, but the rest should be fine. Heal that hound. No, it's going to get away. Yes! Nope! I can't believe how lucky this hound is. Do you know what? You get you get to live. <laughs> Damn that man. Ooh! I got a bit distracted by killing that small ship. I only got flanked there. Okay, let's turn around. We've got a missile cruiser up there. Not that dangerous. on our allies so I've got to try and tank if I can I'm pretty much the only guy that can tank one slot face to face and probably the battle cruise as well I'm gonna say okay I think we've got time to kill this ship right in a second now the onslaught's kind of gone off from the other two so it's point defense is going to be a little bit weaker than it would be normally so we're gonna send uh, the fighter strikes to kill that but I reckon we can take these guys down if we just uh, gank them with the next squads going pretty well at the moment. Though I am concerned about the onslaught moving in on my carry there. I'm on my way though, I'm on my way. As you can see I have actually increased its capacity for flux quite a bit so it's not as weak as it was before. Ooh, no, no, no. Let's do this. Oh one of my ships is damaged. It's only a frigate though. It's going to take a little bit to actually start damaging the onslaught because its armor is so powerful. But once we get enough damage done, it should start going down, hopefully. Let's get a bit closer. Be careful with flux as well. Oh, bombing win! Yeah! Get him, guys! I love bombers, everybody. <laughs> okay, let's be careful with flux, though. This ship is so good with the flux core, it's amazing. Big fan. Oh, he survived. Nice. Let's call in the pocket gust and the calm. Unfortunately, I I changed most of the designs between episodes, but I forgot to do this one in the dock. So I did it on the way over to start the video, and it's just not ready for combat. I, I changed it around so it had more um, peak performance time, and also it had the phase mod as well. Oh, we lost the uh, hail. 
Ah, probably got spammed by fighters, which is not great, but that's it's okay, it's okay. That was the squidgy destroyer, by the way. It's not the the calm's the one that's got good defenses. The hail's the one that's kind of like a glass cannon. So it died like a glass cannon. We should be too surprised there. But so far we've traded a destroyer for a battleship. So I'm gonna say that we're currently winning. Good stuff, guys. Good stuff. Okay, so they have actually spread out their forces a bit too thinly here. So we're gonna do another fighter strike on the battle carrier. This is way weaker than the onslaught. I, I think it's a battle carrier. It's like it's kind of like this guy. It's not going to be winning a lot of one v ones against ships of the same size if it's a combat ship. But it has like I think does it have six fighter groups? Let's have a look. I'm not sure actually. Where does it say how many fighters it has? Four. Oh, it's actually only got four. Do you know what? It's a bit of a dead ship. <laughs> it's a bit potato, everybody. Very nice. Oops. Oh, be careful, these guys. They have, like, mining blasters as their main weapon. <laughs> so they, they hit you really hard. If you had, like, a fleet of those, you'd probably be invincible. Oh, it's the pocket. It's the gust. I've actually renamed it to the hate DSF. Oh no, I didn't rename it. I'm sorry. I was going to rename it to the hate uh, DSF Gus. But I forgot. We'll do it after this. Oh. Yeah, those guys can probably kill me if there was enough of them in one barrage. I reckon. <laughs> they have a lot of uh, d damage there. Yeah, the enemy fleet is massively screwed. They've lost two of their big ships. They've only got two ships left, I think, anyway. I would start attacking it, but there's this in the way, everybody. This is in the way. There you go. I think after this, we can go and attack their main system, because I don't think there's be anything defending them after this. This is the biggest fleet they had in that system. Oh, bombing wing coming in. Oh, I love it! I love it! <laughs> Big fan. The beauty of seeing a torpedo run on the enemy ships is just amazing. I absolutely love it. Oh. See, I kind of said 408 damage to my armor there. That's insane! Are we done here? There's one enemy left and he's running away. I don't think we can catch him though. Oh, wait, no, we got commandos. The commando mechs can do it. If anyone can do it. Are they strong enough to actually take him out, though? Oh, no, this guy is, though. It's my original flagship. Good job, everybody. I didn't think... Did we lose anybody? Maybe. Someone got hurt, but I don't know if they died. Yeah, that was it. Sorry, we lost the hail. That was it. I'm sorry. Your ship is kind of bad, though. I mean, it's too glass cannony for an uh, AI to handle, to be honest. Okay, so we've got that sorted out. Let's go for a mass attack on the utility ships they have. And we got all of them but two, but that's okay. Ship recovery. Let's recover my ship because I get some get some stuff back from that. Do I, is, is there anything I want here? Not really, no. Not really. Okay, cool. We have a lot of this useless stuff I'm going to right now. Done. I'm actually going to head back and we're going to get some stuff before we attack the system properly. Actually, I say head back. We're just going to head to the nearest system that has an, a neutral station. Let's have a look. Let's go to the Sky Nation. Or Sai. Yeah, so what I want to try and do here. I want to get some more cargo capacity so that we because we're going to go raiding and we want to get a lot of stuff we can raid. Uh, let's get a lot more crew. Actually, we've got way too much crew. <laughs> Never mind. I already have loads of crew, apparently. It's fine. 
Um, let's sell the goods we just picked up anyway. Be gone, random goods. Be gone. Get some more supplies. Ah, do we need that really? No, not really. Oh, I didn't realize I had this much heavy machinery. Oh my god. Uh, oh! 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 Done! <laughs> Perfect! After that's finished, we can start building our own ships. I would do it. You can technically build ships now, but they have like a reduction in quality. So I don't want to do it right now. We'll do it when we get a uh, better quality ship. Uh, factory. Anyway, so I did also want to buy... Oh, I can't afford it now, can I? I've made a mistake, everybody. I've made a mistake. To be fair, there's it is, not really any freighters here anyway. It's fine. Don't worry about it, everybody. It's fine. Uh, let's go to... Oh, they're fine. We're just going to attack the enemy. We're trying to go... If we, we haven't got a lot of card capacity, we're trying to go for some, like, luxury goods. Because I'm pretty sure, at least right now, they shouldn't have any defences. Or at least defenders that can stop me. Boom, boom. What's happening then? Oh, we're getting a, a priest scandal. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? That's a bad thing. <laughs> I had to check. <laughs> Who knows of these weird space empires? It's going to be a bit ballsy, isn't it? Is this where the base is? No, it's not. Why, hello there! How's it going? Oh, they're going to come again. with you. <laughs> Fight me! Bring it on. You know you want to. No, they're too scared. They, they haven't got any big ships to actually take me on. Uh, let's go for the one that's out by itself first, because there's one that actually hasn't got a massive military base. Oh, a mining fleet. Hey, guys. Hey! Oh, they're running away. Let's just auto-resolve them. Let's just get a big old auto-resolve going. Nice. I'll take it. To be fair, these... I'm not going to take it. I'll change my mind. Well, we'll take the ones that at least worth a little bit. But most of this stuff is not really worth anything. Oh, <laughs> I want to level up! Okay, we're going to take this one. Industrial planning. All uh, industries supply one more unit of all com commodities they produce for my governed colonies. And for all my colonies, plus 50% maximum value of custom ships and weapon production. So it's not very, very helpful now, but as soon as our, we start making our own ships in our shipyards, it will be very, very helpful. And we can get some cool stuff. And after this, we actually have the capacity to get hull restoration, so we can get rid of some of these demons. Okay. Oh, there's another one! They respawned! <laughs> Damn it! Oh, guys, if we can, I want to capture that um, special eagle there. That'd be great. Okay. He's realized what's that. He's like, wait a second, we're not strong enough for this. You fool! Okay, this is a good... Oh, we got a Perfect. So let's get our ships deployed in, shall we? Let's get those guys in as well. Actually, not that one. I don't... <laughs> it keeps dying, that ship. We keep out of the battlefield. Let's go for this one. Okay, let's go. Now, I really want to try and capture some of these ships, but I don't really know if there's a way you can specifically attack them so they don't get damage. I do know that if you keep attacking the hull it, and you like split in half, it means you definitely cannot recover the ship. But that's pretty much the only thing I know about the situation. Anyway, let's move in, shall we? Oh, do you know what? I forgot to, uh, I forgot to assign the capture commands. Oops, everybody. It's fine. Mistakes were made. But we caught the mistakes and we fixed them, everybody. That's that's what matters to me. Dude, just capture the point, man. <laughs> what are you doing? Look at this poor kite is struggling for its life against a single missile. Oh no! <laughs> There's a giant squadron of commandos. I'm so sorry. Okay. The enemy has appeared. Now. They got a lot of Falcons, I'm noticing. And Falcons have a great flaw. They are a good ship for a cruiser. They're a very light cruiser. But they, because they're so small with the amount of ship weapons they have, they haven't really got any fighter defense. So, um, yes. They're dead. Perfect. Keep in contact. Oh, that was a good hit there. I also love this ship as well. They're very squidgy though. Um, but I think that and the Hammerhead, I think, are probably my favourite destroyers of that mods. 
I think I would probably prefer keeping the hammerhead myself, though. I always go over the hammerhead, personally. Okay, uh, let's back off these commands, shall we? We need to keep... Actually, I'm a bit worried about that. That's a bit scary. Um, let's go over that way. My ally is being pressured by that elite 15th fleet. He's going to escape, isn't he, if I don't kill him now? Ah, he's out there, whatever. I'd rather keep my giant uh, carrier from being destroyed than take down a single enemy. To be fair, he kind of won. <laughs> it wasn't a problem in the end. He won, he won by himself. He's done a good job there. Where is, where is his fighter win? Oh, double onslaught. A bit scary. Okay, let's call in some more reinforcements. I forgot that we have more than one ship, everybody. We killed the rest of them in. Now. How do we deal with this? I need to probably defend on this one, I think. Because we need to make sure these onslaughts do not get my friend there. Uh, destroy that objective. Do you know what? There's, they're, they're, they're next to each other. Avoid, guys. Avoid, avoid, avoid. Unless they split them, we're fine, but I'm just going to tell my guys to avoid them for now. I'm going to focus on the rest of the fleet first. Oh, more to point points. Uh, let's call in the, the all-knowing Gus, which I still haven't renamed. And also... Uh, yeah, let's go for these guys. Don't mind me as I get rid of all my flux. <laughs> Doing down here, it's just milling around. Okay, screw it. I will defend. You guys do your own thing. If we can get a big fight strike on these guys, actually, screw that. Fight a strike the onslaughts. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Dude, what are you, where are you going? No, I messed up the timing. I messed up the timing big time. Oh no. Five seconds. Uh, back. Then. Why are you tanking with your hole? Are you serious right now? Okay, they need to improve the shield AI. That needs to be removed. Omni shield is pretty bad for AI. We're going to get rid of that. Um, that was awful. <laughs> this is why it got damaged. It's because it's got the wrong shield, everybody. Oh, that's not good. That's not good for my flux. But we are winning, though. We are winning. No, 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 no. Those type of bossy drivers and destroy my shield. Screw it. Quick vent. Okay, despite having slight damage there, we have actually managed to kill this onslaught, I think. Good stuff, good stuff. We do thingy. I can't believe we just witnessed my carrier hole tanking. <laughs> What's happening here, everybody? Ooh, don't like that, don't like that. Ooh. Ooh. Dude, do something useful. Go and kill that. 
keep them off me. Okay, we're looking pretty good, we're looking pretty good. Oh, that's not good. Unfortunately, it seems our fighters aren't getting to the... I think they got too much point defense, because our fighters just seem to not be getting here at all. There are there are a few, but they're just being immediately destroyed. To be fair, it has got battleship-sized point defense, so <laughs> it is a pretty powerful ship. Let's get a little bit closer. I'm actually out the range of my anti-armor. But also, he's got too much anti-shield. Oh, here come the yes. That's what I want to see, guys. Over there. Good stuff, guys. Good stuff. Okay, cool. The main enemies are dead. So we've got a few remaining guys that are just going to be putting back and stuff now. Uh, let's let's do some strike missions on the remaining big ships, and we'll just push forward and go for them. Oh, that missile just attacked the other missile. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So at least we witness that in battle, though. Because at least we see that maybe the issue being damaged is mostly due to the AI with the ship, though. And I think that we already have a converter to a front shield, I think, which may be better suited for that. Oh, the rest of them are escaping. Oh, it's our little um, phase ship. Do you know what? This probably isn't a good choice for this ship, is it? It's going to be like quick attack, but it requires a while to actually use that gun. We'll think about replacing that as well. Done. Done. Claim victory. Pursue enemies. Some of them got away, but for the most part, we absolutely destroyed that fleet. Beautiful. Uh, take prisoners. Done. Okay, let's save and let's go for that, shall we? Now, this is a orbital station. We're going to just sit around for a tiny bit here. Get the uh, CR and stuff back up to where it should be. Oh, also, while we're waiting. Um, yes, it's time, everybody. You are the DSF Gus. No, wait. Gus. <laughs> Perfect. At this point, maybe it should retreat as soon as it gets shot. Let's be honest here, everybody. There you go. <laughs> Hmm. Okay, also, I don't think I can actually afford to... Oh, it's already got two built-ins. Accelerate... Sh Where's shields? Shields. Stabilize shields. Shield conversion. I don't have what I need. I don't have what I need. We have to keep an eye out for on shops. Okay, we should be good to go in a second. To be fair, we can probably do it now. But we're just well wait. We'll let the CR go back up. I feel like I was trying to attack me for a second. I was like, very brave, sir. Very brave. Yeah, let's go for it. So this is only a basic enemy. We should be okay, really. We're just gonna... Well, basic station. We can... We, we'll go in. And we will call a... We want to get all the carriers in, don't we? Okay, so we've got pretty much just a massive carrier force. We'll do immediately, we'll do a fire strike on it, and they can just go and hopefully blow up for us. Stop paying attention! Ah! <laughs> Okay, we're trying to keep to the left. Oh, there's a lot of enemies though, isn't there? That'll be fine. Uh, I'll try and keep to the left so we can just attack out, take out the hangar stations first. Actually, do we even need... <laughs> do I even need to be here? Wow, this, this... Wow. Okay, good start, guys. Good start. Good, good, good stuff, good stuff. We'll disable this. 
That was the quickest destruction of a uh, segment I've ever seen. <laughs> Let's keep these kites a little bit. Stay back, kite. Getting a little bit of damage here from the side, but it's fine. If we get rid of this main section here, they shouldn't be able to kill any of my ships anymore. Oh, they disabled my left-hand side um, point defense, which is a bit annoying. Ah, it's gotten away with it. It's gotten away with it. I can't believe it, everybody. It, look at what is this HP at? Is there a way to check? I don't know. <laughs> it's got like no HP. I can't even see the bar. Oh, get him, man! Get him! Yeah! Oh my god, I think he just blew himself up. <laughs> are, you, are, you, are you okay? Buddy? He's okay! <laughs> That's not a problem. That was that was a Luke Skywalker moment right there. He blew up the Death Star. Somehow didn't die. It's not a problem. Hey, now he's got loads of random ships to kill. Uh, let's call in some of our additional smaller guys. Help us out a little bit. Oh, it's not dead, is it? Oh, I'm an idiot, sorry. I forgot there's the hangar section at the end there. Well, I'm not. These, these hounds are pretty annoying. Oh, it, oh, what a beautiful attack. I'll give that a 9 out of 10, guys. Not as good as the first one, but it was a beautiful attack. Come on, and boom. Are they running away now? Yeah, they're, they're out there. We'll, let, we'll claim victory and auto resolve the rest of it. We can invade them. We could invade them. But for now we're just nick stuff instead. Uh let's see. So what can what do we have to what do we have to take, everybody? What do we have to take? Uh we're gonna take Light heavy, not worth it in my opinion. Uh, let's see. I want to do so that's not dangerous. I think we'll take 57 grand of uh, organics. Yeah, I, I, could, I can see that being a good thing. We'll take that game. That's fine. What I'm going to do if I can. We're going to camp this. We're going to be an awful human being. Okay, go to orbit. Okay, next up, we're going to try and grab... Oh, let's wait a little day. Let's wait a day. I think we should actually probably invade them, to be fair. Let's go in. Order bombardment. Tactical. Yes, that's fine. Uh, next up, we're going to go for... Not raid. What does saturation do? Oh, it's just it's just committing atrocities. I think we're good. I think we are good with that one. We'll leave that be. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Proceed with the invasion. Let's go. Let's move our guys in. I'm pretty sure there's yeah, okay. There's no de deficit now to actually having a uh, landing. We are pretty strong. But also, the enemy has some bigger groups. Mostly because they have those heavy weapons, which I really need to invest in at some point. Um, I've got, what, five squads? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, but now, we'll do a double attack on the patrol HQ and the spaceport. 
Actually, wait, what's my ranking? Oh, my, my ranking's 2, 288. We're still doing double tank, just to make sure people are actually okay. Uh, so we do that. Go, 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 guys. And the spaceport. We can capture this. It's going to happen, everybody. And finally, we will deploy you guys on the ground fences. I think that's it, right? Yes. Massive, massive, massive. I probably could have split up more, to be honest, but whatever. Uh, also, do I still have ray points now, or is, is that over? Because we haven't got, yeah, we've got no one left. Okay. We need to get more supplies. <laughs> Because we're quite low, as you can tell right there. We're having a bit of an issue there. Uh, let's get what we can. we still got all these volcanics here, but it's fine. Oh, is that also making me spend more resources? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. We'll dump it for now. We'll come back for you guys later. Just float around randomly. It's fine. I'm going to randomly attack, guys. Because it doesn't seem that we use resources with this pursuit mode. So we can just kill people. <laughs> Oh, I, 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 I flew through the middle of them, game. How's it going, guys? How's it going? We've already got three of the points. They're moving to attack the rest of them. It's, we got this. We hold out for a little bit. It's fine. Yeah, so we've got a little bit of a battle going on here. 58 difficulty. Uh, sorry, 87. That's okay for us. Let's go in. Let's also call in some little guys to capture points for us. Oh, it's quite a spread out battle, this one. Interesting. Though I say that, it always ends up with us being in a giant club anyway, but that's just how things work. Well, the enemy at least, not not so much my fleet. What's those weird noises? <laughs> I don't know. So, in a second we should get some more command points. We're calling the rest of the carrier force. And we're just going to go directly towards the enemy and attack them as soon as they appear. Uh, let's call in the secondary ships. There they are. Now, i got to say, I probably should check what they have first, but I don't think there was anything that dangerous. I think it's mostly the smaller ships. They probably have a few of those, um, what are they called, en Enforcer? Or was it, no, it wasn't Onslaught. The, the, the big heavy gun cruiser, I can't remember what it's called. We, 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 when we look at it, we'll find it when we look at it, it's fine. To be fair, though, I'm not seeing any. Okay, the main enemy fleet is that thing! Dominator. That was it. Okay, if we can get... Oh, there's loads of... Do How many Dominators do you have? <laughs> we have them all, sir. They, they, that one can't even move properly. There may be too much fire for me to deal with here. There's two phase ships. That is very annoying. But it doesn't seem to be phasing. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I was going to say. Worst phase ship ever. I'm actually a bit concerned by the sheer amount of ships they have. Um, but we have already cut. They've already split in half. So they should be pretty good, right? We'll do a uh, strike mission on this one here, and we'll focus this one down first, and we'll go down the line to get all four of them. Now, unfortunately, I can't do much about the enemy phase ships. Uh, they're just going to always be there and be annoying, unless I get lucky. Well, I got hit that guy. Yeet out of there. He's arm out. I'm waiting for my allies to show up. They should be here soon. Okay, let's switch the mission to that one. And let's take this guy down. Ooh! Ow! Oh, I want to see repeat of last mission, everyone. Massive bombing attack! You know what? It kind of survived. That didn't work. It was too powerful. Screw you, Matt. I knew you. I knew you were about to do that.
That was going to make me go forward, but it didn't really work out as I envisioned there. It should already... Yeah, it's armor's down at the front, so we just got to keep pressure on it, and it should die in a few seconds. Though I'm kind of sad that our glorious bombing attack kind of failed there, but it is what it is. We got some more reinforcement points. Let's call in the these two. We'll do the gust last, or the gust, because it's kind of broken, so... <laughs> It's more, It's not really a fighty ship anymore, it's more of just a mess. Oh, this is looking good, this is looking good. It's overloaded. One down. Okay, next one, guys, next one. Woo! And then you got attacked by that big old attack there, that was sucked. Excellent work, guys. Excellent work. Um, it's going to be a bit weird, but I just don't like them. Um, oh, yeah, that last one. They're all gremlins. Just kill the gremlins with fighter strikes. The reason I'm using fighter strikes is that means we can... Oh, actually, you probably need help down there. Um, go and help your friend, guys. Go and help your friend. <laughs> he needs some help, please. He needs some assistance. If we just assign fighters to attack the gremlins, this will happen. <laughs> you can't keep phase forever! Oh no, what a shame, your thing ran out. Okay, while, the, while I'm laughing at their destruction, let's go this way. Uh, they've escaped, good job, good job. I'm going to go and start attacking the main enemy fleet then. One gremlin down. Where are they going anyway? Oh, they're attacking our phase ship, which is already quite hurt. Did I not assign you the retreat of damage thing? I don't think I did. Poor guy. That's probably why I lose more ships than anything, if I just forget to assign them the retreat when damage thing. Because it, it, in my theory, is if they get hit enough to actually have whole damage, that means they're probably about to die anyway. So they should really get the hell out as soon as possible. Oh, that... Just poor kite. I think it survived though. Barely. It's barely survived. Yeah, he is out of there. Okay, next target, everybody. We are going to. The Grim's dead, right? No, he did. I want to see a good old fight strike on the. Dominator there. Okay, I think I can kill this before it... Now it's, it's, it's now blocking his main ally from helping him. <laughs> good job, man. Good job. Come on, either. I am annoying this condor, yes, but it's not really got any weapons on it, so it's fine. We'll just let it go by. Okay, dead. This guy is lit up. Let's get rid of some flux with me. What's that? Sound like someone has crashed into a hole like 20 times. Hey, Mount, from what? I didn't even see anything coming around behind me. This could be bad, everybody. This could be bad. I'm just going towards the enemy without any way of stopping myself. Um, but I killed that Dominator, so it's fine. Uh, stop shooting, guys. Stop shooting. X, by the way. Pretty handy command if you're in a pickle. Press X. Your gun stop shooting. You can kind of save some flux use. Done. Okay, next target, guys. Go for the final one. got this guy down. This, 
this fleet has been destroyed. Once we get rid of the big ships, it's normally just a wrap up, isn't it? We just zoom in, kill everything. Because we've got so many fighters, small ships just aren't a problem for us, really. Apart from these guys. Reason. I thought that was a giant mech. <laughs> I was like, wow, that's huge. We just we deploy the gas at the end just so it's it's made an appearance. <laughs> well, it, it fought in this battle. No one can say it didn't. It was in the battle. That was just a waste of supplies, by the way. I'm aware. It's fine. Uh, so there's what, one enemy ship running away. I don't think my two frigates can kill it, but you never know. They might be able to clutch it. Maybe? Are you okay? Oh, he's fighting now. <laughs> I was going to say he's not even doing anything. He's got away though. He's uh, we're, we're in the battle now. He's, he's literally at the end. He's just escaped. So... That went pretty well. We will do a large scale kill them please attack. And we wipe them all out. Perfect. That gives us way more supplies. Get rid of those. Did we get any upgrades for our... Ooh. The Gus is now confident crew. That is amazing. And we also got a famous ship which is pretty awesome as well. That's good, because I, I still need to... Wait, let's go back into this quickly. I do need to look up what that actually means. It has some kind of effect, but... So we are famous, of course. So we got all the basic effects from that. The crew of the DSF Greatsword is fiercely loyal to its captain, Fretex. Reduce the RDK by 30% and significantly improve the ship's traits. Oh, that is amazing, then. Awesome. How much does it improve it by? I'm kind of curious. Who knows? How's it going, guys? We are down to the last few enemy squads, I think. And then we got this in the bag. We have supplies to actually maintain position. It's gone pretty well. It's gone pretty well, everybody. One more t No, they've recaptured everything as we've been walking around. It's really annoying. <laughs> we'll just maintain position here. Oh. Market captured. Cullen! The water world. I wish I could buy this. Can I buy it? I want to buy it. There should be a battle report, but I'm just not finding it with my brain, everybody. Give me a second. Oh, we don't have enough money. What market size is this? Is it market size 5? I reckon we can afford this. I wonder if because I've captured it, it allows me to buy... Because normally, I'm pretty sure it said that I couldn't buy a market because it was over size 4. Or was it size 5 that was the cap? Regardless, let's have a look. Let's have a look at this place. Is it worth me buying this location? So it's got lobsters. It has ruins. It has not great ore. It has organics. It has water. Oh, it's got... Oh. Had some pretty crazy things there. Um, we won't get this. It's got too. It's got too much hazard for my liking, to be honest. There's too much hazard. Yeah, believe it, believe it. But it doesn't matter too much because we can sell the goods that we have here. Now we also got five high value prisoners. We will sell all that junk. And we cannot forget that we have loads of junk in here as well. As they have no way of stopping me, I'm going to do it on the black market. <laughs> um, no, no, yeah, 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 we'll do it on the black market, it's fine. Let's go and get the cargo pods. Oh, they, they've arrived, they're not happy. Oh, counter invasion force has arrived in the system. Oh, no. How big is your counter invasion force? There's two big fleets coming in. Oh, I was hoping to repair, but I just messed it up. Um, well, at least we've got one fleet at a time. Let's go and attack this one. There's a lot of big battles in this, game, <laughs> this video, everybody. <laughs> There's battles everywhere. 
Uh, yeah, deploy. Be fine. I need them to capture points. That's their main objective. Okay, the front of my armor has been repaired, but the side is still damaged from the last battle over here. So we've got to be a little bit careful with that bit. Uh, let's wait and get that other carrier in, because the carrier that we haven't deployed is the one with the bombing wings, which are pretty handy as we've seen in the past. Hi. This poor hammerhead has made a grave mistake. Let's go for the weak ones, like this guy here. Oh, we lost the sleep right away! Well, that's okay. It was slated to be replaced anyway. And now we can afford to bring the carrier in. It all worked out. What killed that, by the way? I'm kind of curious. It was something over there, I guess. I don't know what it was. Um... Let's not do anything for now. I can see this thing's already injured. For some reason. That's not. I think it's probably because it's got too many demods, maybe. Focus fire. We did that. One more barrage. Yes. Nice. Let's get this Falcon back off. Okay. I want to see a fight strike over there. I also want to see a fight strike on... Why are you assigning that one? That's not, it should be this one. <laughs> Whatever then. We're assigning a secondary one over there. Oh, actually, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble. Damage up. Finish off. Beautiful, excellent. Good job, everyone. It's going so well. The the enemy Navy must be terrified. Like, we just lost, like, 50 fleets in an hour, guys. <laughs> what did we do? Sucks to be you. I'm trying to get closer here, but there you go. This guy is getting out of here. He does not want to fight me whatsoever. I'm a bit concerned because my carriers have gone off to the north to fight a cruiser. So hopefully they'll be okay, but we'll have to find out, I guess. Ooh, they got high velocity drivers. Very handy weapon. Let's actually not get too far in here because we'll get flanked by this enforcer here. If that guy wants to run away, that's fine. I'll kill his friends. Oh, no, he's come back. He's come back. Are you guys okay up there? Looks like they're okay. Oh, they got the haze with them. That's fine. Let's assign another squad to attack. Let's get a fight strike on this eagle. Come on, flux capacity. I think we're okay. I'm just keeping on my flux though. Okay, bombing wing wing is available. Let's do this. This should either end up with like, killing it with one strike or it's gonna get overloaded, I think. Oh, I'm too far away though. Come on, F. Oh, 
Right, maintain the damage at least, because I wasn't in position there. That was my fault. But we got. Oh, overload. There you go. The enemy has been destroyed. So we're going to have to probably immediately repair after this, because otherwise we're not going to be really in fight condition for the next battle. But we have got this under control. I would just end the battle now, but it looks like they're going to take down this Dominator. Maybe? They get it eventually. <laughs> There's no fast sword in this one, they just to make do, but we will eventually get that killed. Let's just get my speed up while I'm waiting. Uh, back to watching. Mm. They may get away actually. It is at the end of the battle. Oh, we're just, we'll let it go, we'll let it go. We we'll auto resolve, kill it. Oh, this is good. This is good. I like... Story points give me brilliant experience, so I'm going to take it for that at least. There is an eagle we can grab. It's already pretty hurt, so we'll leave that be. Repair ships to dockyard. We don't have enough supplies. <gasps> That's crazy. I wish it could at least let me do a partial resupply or something. <laughs> oh no, we haven't got enough stuff. Oh! Back up to full strength, everybody. Nothing even happened to us. We're totally fine. Okay, that's just a quick save anyway. Uh, did I solve the volatiles, like the organics over here? Let's have a quick look. I did. Oh, wait, go back, go back! Don't let them invade! Oh, I think, I'm, I, I think if I'm not there, it will just invade the planet. Uh, we are ready to go. We will attack once more. Once more into the breach, everybody. So I think we have quite a lot of money so far, though. It's gone pretty well. We're definitely not going to take it. We're not going to... We're not buying this. That's not happening. What is this? Flux capacity. Weapon range. Interesting. Also, how are we doing with... Oh, we're so close. If I get, like, another bonus experience we can spend... That'd be great, because then we can actually get to the point where... Oh, the maximum level is 15. I didn't realise there was a maximum level, everybody. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> uh, that means we're probably going to have to forego some of our other ones. Oh, that means we can't get... Where was it? There was one that was really good. I think it was one of these. We may have to remove one of our other traits, I think, at some point. Like, maybe this fighter one. Uh, yeah, I think that could be a good idea, because I really wanted to get this one. Oh, we need one here, though. So I have to get rid of something. Oh, I don't think we can, then. So we definitely need this. And we only have one more point left after that. So we have, maybe if we get rid of one of these. The max movement speed is very useful. I don't really want to get rid of that. The gunning's also very useful. Maybe we can get rid of the ECM. It's only giving us a very small advantage. Also, if I reassign now, will I get bonus points, uh, bonus XP again? Not sure. You only live once, everybody. Let's try it. Nope, that didn't really do what I wanted to do. That's fine. <laughs> Damn it. But at least we got this now. Let's get rid of this. Oh, the big ship survived. Like that as well. Do we... They are engaging us. Let's go in. Well, at least after this video, we've definitely got a lot of combat done, though. <laughs> you cannot say this video does not have combat in, because it has a lot of combat in. Okay. 
Okay. This should be pretty easy, I think. We're just going to smash through it as soon as possible. I don't think we're going to have the... Because that was already a pretty dodgy invasion we just did, because I think without the orbital bombardment at the start, it would have been an equal battle in terms of marines. So you need to get some actual, like, more marines or some allied fleets to help us invade the rest of that territory. We will look into that between episodes. But I can also just call invasion fleets in to help me out in battles. Uh, they spawn in, come and attack. It's pretty cool. There's a lot of damage coming my way. Let's back up a little bit. Um, I'm going to call in some more small ships that we're capturing. Oh, it's those weird lance things. I, if I find some of those, I'm going to try and build loads. I think they are pretty cool. I don't think there's much point doing fight strikes at this point because we've already they've already been deployed and kind of already lost most of HP. But at least we can get rid of these carriers that are for some reason at the front of their formation, not the main combat ships. What the hell? <laughs> What's that Reaper Torpedo doing? It's embracing its wild side. How are we doing with capture points? Oh, there's a gremlin over there. We probably need help with that. I'm going to assign somebody to go and attack it with the fighter squad. Because it's going to kill my ships otherwise. The face ships is just too much of the AI to handle all the time. Oh, now we've got negative 9% range, which is pretty annoying, but... It's fine. Taking a lot of damage in my flux here. Oh, that guy's nearly dead though. Finish it. Got it. Oh! <laughs> Those are crazy. Okay, let's let's realign out what we're doing. Let's go over this way. My carrier is having a bit of a bad time here, but he's already done a lot of damage to the enemy's ship as well. I think we can get it. It's going to be a bit risky though. Oh, unfortunately I think most of my guns are offline from the attack earlier. Oh no, we got it. It's fine. Got some guys pulling back. I think we're being flanked at this point from the enemy, but they're too far away to actually. Oh no, they're going somewhere else. Let's find them. This is a bunch of small ships left now. It should be easy to take care of. And we're assigned a command to fight or engage the last big ship. And also, oh, there's a bunch of gremlins as well. Let's just do this. There you go. Actually, I can do this myself as well, can't I? I can have out my fighters. I don't normally like using them on engage command to let them defending my ship, but they can just go out and do their own thing. Like right now. Although they're not doing it. <laughs> oh wait, that's this. Oh sorry, these are my ones. Fair enough. Okay, so the enemy is this way. The only problem I find with uh, using... Bong. 
The engage command is that you lose a little bit of flux, so you lose the speed boost if you haven't got certain skills. But apart from that, it's, it's pretty, pretty good idea to leave it on most of the time. They can take care of that condor themselves. I will go for this guy. There's a gremlin. Easy. It's a shame that the enemy hasn't got a bigger fleet really. But I feel like as well, because we're using mod factions, they are stronger than the base game factions. I mean, I, I know they're trying to balance them out, but they are just stronger in a lot of cases. But then again, I, I say that, a lot of my ship designs at the start were... Because we've kind of made like a lot of tailor-made ship designs. And we kind of want to get rid of certain ones that aren't that great. So we are trying to get rid of ships that aren't brilliant. Where they are just use any ship they can get, really. They're not going to be like, this ship sucks. They're not going to use it at all in our fleet. They'll just use it as part of their army. Oh, that's a danger close, danger close. Why is he so aggressive? Done. The rest are running away. We're just in the battle now. We're not going to bother chasing the rest. We're just doing a pursue. And that, everybody. I think it's going to be it for today's episode. I think we did pretty good progress there. We got a load of kills. We leveled up. We have the trait. I am definitely going to try and go for this because this is amazing. Support Doctrine for our final skill. Uh, gain non-elite helmsman damage control on combat endurance for all ships without officers. The point points cost reduction by 20% or 10 points, whatever is less. That's really cool. That's amazing. We definitely need that as soon as possible. And also it means that I can get one of these. Officer training or officer management. Um, I think it was... I want, one more. I want more levels. Oh no. What one do we get? Plus one maximum level. We'll go for this one. We get more... All our ships will be better with the guys in command. They get more elite skills. We get more command points. We get more operatives. Instead of just having more officers. Yeah, let's go for that. Done. So now, I'm pretty sure my guys should be able to level up. Yes, they can. Oh. This guy could already level up. What are you flying? You're flying the Gus, right? Uh, just some expertise. Yes, that's a good one to get. Done. We will probably go over that a bit later when we can. But apart from that, everybody, thank you for watching. I will quickly say, though, um, I will probably not do a video in two days' time. Because there's a game coming out. Oh wait, no. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I was gonna say I want to. I want to do a stream for um, Plague Tales that comes out on the 18th, but this comes out on the 17th, so it's not a problem. So it's all good, everybody. Everything's completely normal. Actually, depending on how it goes, we may play. We may stream Plague Tales a second time if it's really fun. But I will carry this on as soon as we can. So I, I think we got. Because I am gonna end this by the 25th when Battle comes out. This series will be ended, everybody. I, I'm just gonna put it out there right away because Battle Lord. Is what most people want to watch. <laughs> so that has to happen. That has to happen. Uh, but we will try and go for at least another three or four episodes until the 25th looms on us. And then we'll be moving on. But it's been pretty fun so far. I have got to the point where we are pretty powerful. I think what we need to do before we end the series though is definitely get myself a Dreadnought. So we're going to try and save up from that. And actually I'm saying this. We are already doing pretty well with the old money right now. So I'm pretty sure we can probably already afford one if we can find one. Now the problem I've been having though. Well, actually, we need a little bit more money. The problem I've been having, though, is that there's only, only one place that sells them. And every time I try and get... I, I tried to buy it two episodes ago, and it was gone. So I had to wait for it to reappear, then I can buy it. But we'll get there as soon as possible. Apart from that, everybody. Thank you for watching. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below. And I'll see you next time. Bye.